Take a moment and look around this glorious city of yours. It wasn't long ago this was all plasma mines. Naboo has indeed come a long way. But as we chart a bold course for the future, let us never forget our past. Sheev Palpatine approximately around 4000 BBY, Gris Multi people had discovered the planet, which they had named Naboo, after one of their principal deities. Naboo quickly became notorious as a vacation spot and as a private hunting preserve amongst big game hunters across the mid-rim, although it would be around a century before permanent human settlement. Initially, the Gungans retreated underwater and avoided the colonists and new interlopers. While the Gungans flourished for thousands of years before, this only lasted until around 3900 BBY, a group of human colonists from Grismalt fleeing a brutal civil war crash landed on Naboo. Led by Quillan, the colonists ventured into the Gallo Mountains, created a farming community at the Dia Peak, establishing their presence on the planet and eventually taking its name for themselves. The Naboo calendar based its epoch around the arrival of Quillan. Tensions arose between the two peoples, and they started separate and apart from that point on. When the Gungans finally met the colonists, diplomacy failed and the two species fought a series of wars over territory and resources before largely resolving to live apart and ignore each other.